is the Laugh Time Show. Preparing for shows is good. Wait, it is good, right? You could have put that part. Preparing for shows. And then this part, we're making fun of it. But you could put that part at the beginning of the show when I couldn't, when I couldn't say anything and I was an idiot. Hey, welcome to the Laugh Time Show, everybody. I'm Sean. It is Bob over hey, here. Hey, I'm Bob. Hey, how's it stole going, I stole your name. I stole your thing for you, but yeah. Well, I made a list. All right. All right. We're going right to this, huh? Well, I got to find the list. It's in notes. <laughs> Nobody's watching this part. <laughs> Just warming up. How long beep, we got? Beep, 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 beep. How long do we have? Okay, Dad. Yeah. Gonna interview you now. Okay. Ready? Ready. Got a whole list of questions prepared. For the first time, I prepared something for the show. Okay. It's all about you. We don't do this often. Like Should I be real, scared? real talking. You don't well, have to be this a character. Is a, this is uh, unmasked or unplugged. Wait. Ron and Fez does... Unscripted. No, something like that. I forget what it is. Shit, I gotta think of it, though. Well, I unmasked. scripted the... These aren't off the top unmasked, of my head right unmasked, now. Unmasked, unmasked. These ideas are an hour and a half old. I was on their shitter. And this is what I thought of here. So, Dad. Yo. Would you prefer saying, I'm up for it, or I'm down for it? They basically mean the same thing. I'm up for it. You, okay. Rolling right along here. Number two. Keep track at home. Just a psychological test of what this is. I'm going to get a score at the end. I didn't go into that kind of detail. We can that would be you want. I, my first answer is optimistic, by the way. Maybe I'll put in the answer. No, it's going to take too long I said if I put up in or down. Answers. Up is optimistic, down is pessimistic. Uh, shit, I pasted a 1 800 number Way right to in go. there. Did you, so Sean, did you let know me ask you could your shake question. your phone and undo it? Okay. Do you use phones much, Sean? Yes. Okay, it just seems like you didn't know how to use a phone. But there. not for phone things. Okay, resume the questions, I use please. phone as a computer. I don't okay. use it to talk and phone. call and stuff. All right, but we can accept that answer. All right. Number Back two. Okay, sorry. Let's see how long it takes to get through this. You know, we, we always it go to long. a different subject. Mm -hmm. Okay, number two. We're going to fire right through this. No ADD night. What do you go think ahead. of people who are colorblind? Uh, what I think of them? Yeah, what do you I think? I think they're liars, what I think. You think they can really see color? Think I think they, they really can see color, yes. They're not colorblind. They're liars. I want to see a certificate that they're colorblind. All right. And then I want to see the certificate, because on a certificate, he's going to say, are they, are they colorblind to colors on the color scale or skin colors of people? There's two different colorblinds. Okay, next question. <laughs> I'm going to call back to that first one. So you're up for this interview then? Yes, okay. I am up for this ah, interview, yes. Just thought yeah. of that. I just thought ah. of that. All right. Yeah. Go Should back. have said that initially, but okay. so you don't really care about colorblind people. Like uh, that's nope. not well, that's not one of the questions. That's kind of a second part. I just added it right now. You that, added a second yeah, question without awesome. asking me. I riffed that one. You riff the question. Okay. Riffed. Now number three. I'm reading. Sorry, everybody. I'm reading. Read. There's your camera right there. Would you? I know. Would you? No, you. Would you? Would you? Number three. How many would times you, did I answer that? I wrote it all that time. Okay. I don't know. No. Must yeah. been, my, my phone must have been actually. You up. spelled it different. And no. Okay, fine. I'll wait till you're done. Oh, I'm done. I'll wait till you're done drinking. I'll wait till you're done. All right. Would you be afraid of a spider that is bigger than you? Yes. Absolutely. That's a resounding yes. Well, it's a resounding yes. Yeah. The fucker is apparently going to have eight legs and he's going to use big mandible fangs and he's probably going to cut my neck off with his fangs. I assumed. You would say so. I, I assumed you wouldn't. You would Anybody would. Wouldn't you I, say you're scared of spiders? You're being honest. Really? A spider's bad enough. People are afraid of the you're, little tiny things. Yeah. And then when it's bigger than you? Anything, who heard of that? that just, I had dreams about that, actually. When anybody I naturally is afraid of things bigger than them. Bigger. Into the microphone, Bob. Bigger than them. Get it? Bigger? Next there's question. a song. There's a propeller head song. Big, bigger. I may have bigger for you. I may have bigger, bigger for you. Bigger. bigger, do, bigger. Do, do, do. Uh, I don't no, remember oh how it shit. goes, but you can't. Okay, you gotta be careful. You can't. You gotta be very careful. We're going over track. We very might be quickly. going. We yeah, but we might it's have went too we far with minutes. that YouTube. Okay, wait, hold on. With YouTube. Next question. We might question. be able to po not post that because we even mentioned that song. <laughs> we got, <laughs> we got ten minutes. Okay. All 
Right, we got time. Know. What's going on with me right now? Okay. Number four. Do you want to be able to breathe underwater without any help? Do I want to be able to breathe underwater without any help? You're That'd be pro- you're awesome. Probably thinking of That'd this be awesome for the first time, so you can take your time. That'd be awesome. If I don't have to have gills, I don't want to slit inside of my head. I just want to be able to breathe underwater naturally. Be great. I guess everybody would want that ability. I mean, there's no, there's no like downfall. Just that. imagine just the opportunities the if you can do that, though. Yeah. Two thirds of the world's so surface is said. underwater. There's so much underwater. We have not seen it. And riches and ha. Oh, Treasures and um, let me tell you something. History. Shh. Fun fact: Jacques Cousteau is Jacques. pissed off that he can't breathe underwater. He is pissed. Jacques. He has to put all that shit on and go under there. Otherwise, he could just go under there and just imagine the documentaries. Jacques says, "Hey, I can't talk French, but if he if I was talking French, hey, I'm going to the bottom of the ocean. He just jumps in and walks the fuck down to the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> He's breathing. Maybe let awesome. me help you out here." Hey, let me go to the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Okay. Hey, let me breathe underwater. I go to the bottom of the ocean. Without yeah, anything. They That's do the pretty sea good. and the ocean. All right. See, know. we're getting off track again. My name you, is Sean. You're right. It's very dangerous okay. for us Any, to go off yep, track. Yep, but we got to talk about podcasts, some of these. These are like really... They are. These are it, really like um, things that like, they make you think. Like you never thought you'd be able to breathe underwater. And now you're course suddenly line. The course line you got to think about it. I'll okay. put this in post. Course Number line. five, drugs. Fine. Yes. What about them? Drugs, question mark. What does that mean? That's the question. What would the answer be? Is if you that your you? answer? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't have to be anything. So there's no question. You just said a fucking word. You can say any word like has that. has a question mark at the end, so that means it's a question. Really? Now, what it's pertaining to is a that would be different a, thing. <laughs> you just can't say a word. and that's, that's not a question. Pertaining to... What's the, what's the question pertaining to drugs? People can... Like, if somebody's like, I was doing drugs, and somebody's just like, drugs? Like, they want to know more. I don't know. No. There's more to the question, so I can't give the answer. I, yeah, okay. I just wanted to have a one-word Some drugs question, are good. Some drugs are very one. bad. That's my answer. That's a lot of fun. Okay. <laughs> Six. What is the first thing that comes to your mind after you close the door? Any door. Any old door will do. Any old door will do ya. I'm in, the, I'm in the space inside the door? No. What's the first thing that comes to mind after you close a door? The simple act of closing I'm a door. I'm in that space. I'm in that space then. Okay. Okay. Separation. Fair. You want that's that? fine. Close the door, separation from whatever's well, outside that door. Well, that's not the first thing. That would be the second thing then because you changed it. First thing was that you're in a new space. Second <laughs> thing is separation. <laughs> what if the door never opens? You know, I smashed the fucking window. What's the third thing you think about? It's a two-parter. No. Okay. Now, f- six. How much time we got? We got to speed through minutes. this. Six. What minutes. is the first? Th- uh, we did. Do- we just did number six. See, I'm. I'm seeing if you're paying attention. I'm not. Not to the numbers of the questions. Seven. I'm sure, you have fifty questions. I'm do sure. you think a giraffe's neck is entirely too long? Yes. Okay. Eight. Are you for eliminating the calendar and not keeping track of time anymore? Yes. Me too. Actually. Totally. Sorry, this isn't for me. But. Totally, because the calendar is whizzing by way too fast, and I don't know what fucking day it is. I do agree. Okay. And we're getting through it. Number nine. Yes. Have you ever worn sunglasses to bed? Yes. You have? Yes. To bed. Like, I, you're like, I'm going to bed now. You get... Before I went to sleep, I took them off. But I went went to bed with sunglasses on. Really? And took them off. Yeah. Doing vacation I hear all the time. A lot more about that. We do on vacation all the time. We lay down and we sunglasses still on. You as didn't a joke. go to bed. Oh, okay. As a joke, and you just take them off. Then, yeah. You wearing them all day? Oh, oh yeah. That's a weird. That's a weird question. Who thinks of this stupid? No. Random. I gave the answer. What kind of an idiot? Ten dollars. Yes, ten dollars. If there were moon glasses, what do you think they would look like? Moon? I don't know. Explain moon glasses. I don't know. You mean looking at the moon with the glasses? No. 
I guess, because sunglasses aren't for looking at the sun. Just, you know, if you wore special glasses because the moon's out. That would be awesome. Just doesn't matter what they do or what What do you think they Wait, would look like? get this. Would they be darker? Would they be, maybe they would be li- lit up. They'd be see, lit you're up. You're not answering, I'm answering they'd for They'd be them. lit up. They'd be, they'd be, you would see more light through these yeah. glasses. And guess what else you would see? They would brighten the night. And they would be like a thousand power. You would look up to the moon. You would see craters. You would actually see the fucking lunar rover guy thing, whatever that thing is up there. You would see the wheels on the vehicle sitting on the moon waiting for something to come back to drive. You would see that with the class. You'd be, oh, it's a pretty full moon tonight. Oh, there's a rover. Holy shit. Look at those wheels. That'd be awesome. Yeah. That's what the glasses would be like. Number two. Otherwise, you wouldn't buy them. Okay, number, number, that's number nine. You're paying attention. You know exactly what number. Number two. That was actually you, number ten. Nine was sunglasses. I'm going a little too fast. Okay, number eleven. Does having an eleventh question and it being the last question make you uncomfortable? No. Why would it? Okay. And what's the question? That's it. <laughs> that was the question? That was Does the, the last question. question make me uncomfortable? Because you never said question ten. I did ten. If there were moon glasses, what do you think that, that was would nine. look like? I thought that was nine. Play the nine tape. Nine was. Back. Have you ever worn sunglasses to bed? Play the tape. Eight. <laughs> are you eliminating? Are you for eliminating calendar? Okay. Now number ten, we got through. Number eleven. Does having an eleventh question and it being the last question make you uncomfortable? And it does not. <laughs> okay. Number twelve. How many cartwheels have you done today? This is a five-parter. Are you serious? How many cartwheels have you done today? Um, zero. Okay. In the past week? <laughs> zero. All right. In the past year? Why is this a serious question? Zero. All right. In your life? Zero. You have never done a cartwheel? No. Okay. And, and of course, the fi- fifth part is if you said yes, was anyone with you? Well, was anyone with you when you didn't do a cartwheel? No. Okay. The end.